GGG now 31 and oh and who didn't see this coming um now i i'm hoping that our next time we see a ggg fight it's versus a miguel cotto uh possibly a mayweather which <laughs> the chances of that happening is like slim and fucking none uh floyd mayweather oh i just said floyd mayweather but manny pacquiao uh i wouldn't mind seeing him up against peter quillen but definitely some of the higher level guys i don't want to see him up against none of these lower level guys anymore i want to see him up against some of the higher level guys and that's the problem with boxing is we hardly ever see that now we're going to see sergey kovalov versus bernard hopkins and that's a special treat and my hat go off uh to bernard hopkins he doesn't duck challengers that man will take on any challenger you put in front of him but this man right here uh, Gennady Ganovkin is a beast. He is a beast, and nobody wants to fight him, and I don't blame him. Um, accurate, powerful, hits like a fucking mule. I mean, you, you're not going to slug it out with him unless you're a Sergey Kovalov or a Deontay Wilder or one of those bigger fighters. He hits like a fucking heavyweight. So uh, I would also, I also wouldn't mind seeing the uh, Andre Ward fight versus Gennady Ganovkin as well, but that i mean <laughs> andrew ward has been fucking ghost thanks to his promotional company but anyway congrats to Gennady ganovkin peace